In many of my previous videos, I have mentioned that you can easily start a simple biotech company and scale it up and earn crores of rupees and dollars. Now, one comment I observed, which has come repeatedly in any of most of our videos, actually, that should I do a PhD and then I should start a biotech company? So to answer that question, what are the advantages and disadvantages I'm going to discuss in this video to answer you in one line? No, it's not required. But yes, if you want to create something bigger, but let's keep that for the later part of the video. Let me start with the simple part, which is you really don't need a PhD to start a biotech company. So I'll tell you a story. This story is of Henry Ford. Henry Ford, somebody had, um, you know, put him into legal trouble. So he was in standing in the court and the lawyer was uh, started asking him that you don't know anything. You have no idea uh, about uh, automobile. So if you don't have any idea of aut automobile, how can you ha have a car company? You are just a fraud. So, you know, uh, Henry Ford said that, you know, you don't need a knowledge of automobile industry to run a successful automobile company. You need the right set of people in your team who will educate you on that. Now, having said that, the same part applies to you. You don't need to do yourself a PhD in biotech to start a simple biotech company. Instead, you can hire PhDs who will educate you on the nuances wherever a PhD skill set is required. Now, having said that, this is something which most of the young, uh, you know, bachelor's and master's degree students are overlooking. They are thinking that either you should go for a government job or you should go for a job in the industry or you should go for a PhD in a job uh, in academia. But this is a fourth pillar of biotech industry, which is agar koi, if somebody is not starting a biotech company, how would you get the job, boss? So you can be that facilitator. You can start a simple biotech company. But if you are in a dilemma, I don't have a PhD, so I cannot start a biotech company. That's not true. See, by the time you will finish your PhD, either you will be married or you will have two kids and uh, you will be already in need of money. So you will obviously go the job way. Instead, if you start early, like you are in the you know final year of bachelor's or master's and uh, first year of master, and that time only you come together with maybe two friends and you start a company, a simple biotech company, and you can always take my help in doing that. And then later on, scale it up, make it big, make it large. That way you will be able to generate a lot of employment in the industry and of course, earn a lot of money. And you don't need to look for a job because you would have created jobs for others. I think that's a noble job. But having said that, now coming to that part that where PhD will come handy is when you want to start a complicated biotech company, which is really complex. And it's not that if you have a PhD, you will succeed. But yeah, if you are already in enrolled in a PhD or you are uh, going about to finish your PhD or you have finished the PhD, you have to think how can you commercialize your PhD or how can you commercialize a part of your PhD? How can you use your PhD knowledge to start a biotech company, to develop products and to develop services which can be utilized by others. This is where PhD will come handy. So it is not that PhD people are at disadvantage or MSc people are at disadvantage. You are only at a disadvantage when you don't decide whether you want to start a company or you don't want to start a company. If you are you know, stuck in between, you can always come to me and talk to me and we can sit together and I can help you. But if you are like, uh, you know, I want to start a company, but I'm not getting the right infrastructure, the right funding, the right mentor. If you keep waiting, then nothing will happen. Nothing. No, no company will start. It will just be that you're wasting your time. Instead, take action. Take action today. If you want to start a company, reach out to me. Come and meet me in Bangalore. We can sit and discuss how can we take you forward. But at the same time, if you don't want to do it, okay, be very clear that you don't want to do it and you want to go for a job. And then I have made several videos which will guide you on getting a job in the industry. But keep in mind, if you are not getting a job today, that is because the previous generation was having a job mindset, not an entrepreneurial mindset. If more companies are opened in biotech industry today, only then in the future, more people will get jobs. I believe that is the only solution to the problem which biotech industry faces. If we want to create more jobs and more companies has to start and the person who's watching this particular video has to take the initiative. If you want to start, come and uh, meet me in Bangalore and I'll guide you. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you soon in the next one. Till then, keep shining. Bye-bye.